I love fresh. I love fresh. I love fresh. I love fresh so much. It's like coming into the homiest place in the entire world every day. You're exposed to experiences that you never can imagine. All the teachers are really interesting. They have innovative ways of teaching. They really inspire you to want to be learning Torah. The rabbis here, the faculty, the administrators are all so awesome. And you could sit down and talk to them, talk to them about issues that you're having, anything. I love Fresh because there's so many different ways to get involved. After school programs and there's different clubs. There's always something to look forward to, something exciting going on in school. When I walk into the building in the morning, I'm always excited to start a new day. It's never boring here. There's always something fun going on. We expect a great deal of our students. It's not only that Fresh kids work very hard, we really believe in the pursuit of excellence. We ask them to be very serious about a whole bunch of classes every single day and to be seriously engaged in intellectual and religious pursuits. At the same time, we don't want to deprive them of their childhood. And we take advantage of every single opportunity to find ways to make school pleasant and fun. High school kids who are happy are much more receptive to the messages we'd like to deliver. They really care, they really listen. The highlight of my day is when I observe classes and I see students learning with smiles on their faces. And I see that they get it. They really get it. Our faculty fosters their joy and love for learning where they construct sophisticated and dynamic classes where their subjects just come alive. What I love most about teaching at Frisch is being part of a growing and learning community where the teachers are constantly reevaluating themselves and looking to grow and to reach the kids in the most effective ways possible, and where students are genuinely excited to learn new things and expand themselves. I think it's something unique to Frisch that, that the faculty really comes with, with a passion. The faculty are, are people here that the kids can relate to in a real special way. We make it clear from day one that we're there for the students, whatever they need. For me, choosing a high school was a really difficult decision. I decided that I wanted to come to Frisch because the teachers really seemed very enthusiastic and very inspiring. And at the end of the day, that was what I thought was most important, was that I would be surrounded by people who want me to learn. Every person has their place. The rabbis here, the teachers here, they all want to help you, the students, everyone's friends. It's truly such a special place to be. The Gemara. The Gemara raises our question many, many years ago. Let's look. The Berchas Hamazon Eimach Zirnosa. So there's a difference between Shmona Esrei and benching on Rosh Kodesh. What do you think that difference is? Frisch is a school that takes Judaism and Halacha very seriously. One of the primary goals of the Frisch school is to foster in our students a feeling of passion for Torah and mitzvot. What we want is for our kids to feel the music and poetry of Torah reverberating through their lives. So what do we use? We use the Tehillim from David HaMelech. It's so important theologically for us to remember what God did for us, that He's present in our everyday lives. Do you understand that? In elementary school and other places I, I went, they, they read Gemara and Rashi, Tosvot, and that's about it. In Frisch, we spend hours on one topic viewing it from all different angles. My passion is getting into that classroom and teaching Gemara. What we try to do is to show the sophistication that exists within the Talmudic text and show the intricacies so that the student is excited and says, wow, there's an entire creative world here of Jewish thought that I can tap into. And now that I have those skills, it's like, whoa, I'm so excited. And if you light that spark, then they want to go out and they want to keep on learning. What might the Gemara now have? In Gemara, we have been using iPads, which show a different aspect on the Gemara because now we can read, translate, and punctuate the Gemara and share it with everyone else in the class. It's really an amazing school and they help you accomplish so many things academically, but not only that, they focus on all the other things and just enjoying yourself and having a great time and you really develop relationships with all the teachers and all the rabbis. I present you with Daniel Boone. <laughs> Daniel Boone was about 5'7", five, 5'8". How do you know he was 5758? Five, because the newspaper article I read from that. In my American history class, Mr. Tamboro, he doesn't just teach us what's in the text, or he doesn't just tell us the history, he brings in more. It really gave us a whole new outlook on that part of history. The key to Frisch is the sense of community that's here. It's a very 
intimate school. The kids try for personal excellence. They also cooperate. They help each other. They're friendly to each other. I feel grateful for what Frisch has made me. So on, a, on any given opportunity, I take, I take that chance to, to give back. I'm currently involved in Frisch Friday Morning Learning, which brings college students as well as myself back to Frisch. And we, uh, we give chaburos. In addition, I also run uh, Thursday Night Learning at YU. In Frisch, we have an atmosphere where critical thinking, sophisticated ideas all come together under the umbrella of Torah scholarship and Western thought. My interdisciplinary paper is going to be about the tension between individualism and collectivism in Jewish thought and American democracy. I'm very excited to be in a class and given the opportunity to do research with Rutgers University where we sequence DNA and analyze proteins. I was definitely nervous about coming to Frisch from such a small school, but once I got to Frisch, just all the teachers helped me out with everything. They made sure that I was okay. It makes you feel like you're being recognized and that you're not just one kid in a big grade of 137 kids. Urgit was so much fun. Basically, it was a Shabbos of just excitement, full of energy, and making new friends things that Frisch is committed to and is focusing on individual students. One of the ways that we do that is the freshmen coming in, not only are they assigned regular guidance counselors, but they also have a program which meets every other week in smaller groups where they get to meet with a faculty member and discuss issues, Jewish values, life. We don't believe in one-size-fits-all education. We track because we want students to be able to achieve excellence at various levels. Success is a much better motivator than failure. We don't say what is a child capable of. We say where are they coming from and where can we lift them up to. We feel very committed to creating an, a whole individual that you're not just in your Judaic studies classes a Jew and then in your secular classes you're someone who goes out into the world. We want them to be prepared. They should know that things like stem cell research and people are cloning. There's no aspect of life today that the Torah doesn't deal with. One student will bring something in from history. One student will bring something in from English. I teach Tanakh and we'll use it to enhance the lesson. Academically, Frisch definitely prepared me for college and for Israel for the year. But more importantly, I think Frisch provided a nurturing environment that allowed me to really thrive in college and challenge myself but feel really rooted and grounded in my Jewish identity. What makes Frisch so special is the amount of extracurricular opportunities that it provides its students. There's art, music, drama, mishmar, Israel activism, debate, mock trial. I'm actually part of the mock trial team. In my elementary school, I wasn't part of any, really any teams. And once I came to Frisch, I had all these new opportunities. On the basketball team, varsity this year, as a captain, you just have to make sure they're working hard and they're always giving it their all. The Frisch Intramural Football League is a time for everyone to come together to play, whether you're a freshman, a sophomore, a junior, or a senior. It's a special time you get to play with the rabbis. Everyone looks forward to Fridays after school. We get to all come together, play football. The art program in Frisch is something so unique and special to Frisch. There's so many different opportunities to get involved. For the past four years, I've been taking music lessons, particularly rock, and ever since I came to Frisch, I've been introduced to jazz and music theory. In the spirit of Frisch, our concept here is uh, to approach everything with an idea of getting the kids engaged. And the way to do that is you really have to listen to what it is they're interested in doing. We don't really see education as divided into formal education and then fluff. Our informal education programs are clearly well designed to fit into the overall religious and intellectual goals of the school. Shiri has a week long of the entire grade working on projects, working on hallway, working on song. During that week you're just like, how are we ever going to get this done? And then that final night comes and you walk into the gym and you get these chills. You're so excited. You want to start working on the hallway. You want to start working on the art. You want to be here till 2 in the morning, which is something so special. Who wants to stay in school till 2 in the morning? But that's what Frisch kids do. They're here. They want to be here. What they do with their murals and their banners is just the most unbelievable thing. They take a topic and they explore it and they learn it textually, but they also get to explore it visually. Um, and this enhances their learning. What makes Frisch so unique and special place to be is 
that the learning doesn't stop. It's not confined to the four walls of a classroom. You can go out during a program, during our Teshuvah program, our Yom Ha'atzma'ut, our Yom Hazikaron program, any Chagiga. And when you sit there, you get a sense of a Jewish community. We have things like Girls' Night Out where we go to a teacher's house or to a restaurant and we learn Torah and we you know, hang out with the teachers and with our fellow classmates. We have things like Model UN and Debate. And we also have things like Chassad Days where we leave school and we do Chassad in our broader communities. The way the students at Frisch contribute to their school is incredible, but what's also salient is what they do in their communities. I really want to educate as many people in the school as to what's going on in Israel. The faculty in Frisch provides us with the right tools with the different programming. Israel has their own army, but we're the army on this side of the world for Israel. Last year as a freshman, I went to volunteer at a soup kitchen, and this year as a sophomore, I went to Care One, which is a nursing home. There's so many people that are here to help guide the students. There's guidance counselors and teachers and everybody. Not only are you able to gain the skills necessary to excel at college, but you gain the skills necessary to get into college. I'm proud to say I went to Fish. I'm excited to tell people I went to Fish. I'm, I'm happy and very thankful and grateful that Fish bestowed upon me the Judaic and secular knowledge to be the person I am today.